First of all, I would like to thank you all, every one of you, that you have been marching the whole year and you are standing with the people of Gaza every day in, in every corner of Ireland. And you came today in big numbers to show your solidarity and your humanity and your true Irishness. The genocide started 76 years ago. It's not in the last year. Our parents and our grandparents, they suffered the same that we have suffered. But the last year is the worst. Israel showed its real face, in a human face. We, the time I spent there was the worst time in my life. It was a daily torture. And now, when I think about the people there, and when I see their photos, I feel they are aging. They are 10 years older than their real age. I cry. Our hearts are bleeding for the last year and before. And our tears is not stopping. I thought, when I came out of Gaza, I will be okay. But unfortunately, every day we are suffering. All the Palestinians here who are outside of Gaza, they are crying every day, every day for their people in Gaza and their families. I want to tell you something, I will be short. Alexander the Great invaded the whole Middle East and Europe and he reaches Gaza and he asked them to surrender and the crazy people of Gaza refused to surrender if you think of it logically it's a losing battle but the people refused to surrender to Alexander the Great and they fought him at the end eventually he get in he, sur he, he surrounded Gaza for weeks at the end he managed to get in Gaza city but he gave forgiveness for the people because of their courage and their braveness to fight Alexander the Great. I think the Israelis or the Zionists, they made a big mistake when they came to Palestine. and we are ready to sacrifice for freedom and justice, whatever it takes. Because the price of being a slave is much, much higher than being a free and live as a free person. and we will die free. Sometimes, to be honest, I feel sorry as a human being for those evil Zionists because they are, because they lost their humanity, 
They are outside the track of the human nature. And that's what they do when they, like now they're attacking Lebanon and they've done every crime you can imagine and you can't imagine. Because they know they have impunity and the United States is supporting for the Israel and giving all the backing, military and diplomatic. I want to thank you again and I want to say on behalf of the people of Palestine and the people of Gaza to each one of you, thank you, you are in our heart, Ireland is a twin sister of Palestine because you are, the Irish people are free people. Continue doing what you are doing. Boycott, demonstrate. Every act of solidarity means a lot for us. Your solidarity, when I was in Gaza, kept me alive. Don't give up. We will not give up. And we will not stop. And you will not stop until Palestine is fully liberated and all the humanity come together. And we want, even in this very difficult and hard time, I want to say that we want to spread in this world love and the humanity. And by love, we defeat all their evil.